KSW. All right, Steve, this is... Uh, oh, boy. It's already started. It's already started. It's already going. I wish they'd been with us for like the last 10 minutes. I know. Oh, no, we were just going bananas in you here. You know what? We, I'll tell you what, Greg, Greg you and I should... We, we should think about doing a podcast. We I don't know if anybody would listen, but you and I would enjoy it. We'd have a great the, time. Yeah, we would. It'd be a very loud, fast podcast. <laughs> you know, I, this, I, 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 let me tell you something. I haven't been here in years. I don't know what happened to you, man. Maybe it's the juicing, the weight loss. <laughs> Maybe there's more sunshine because it's 2012. I don't know. But you're a different BJ Shay than I the am. one I love. I, I heard you on the last call. He's like, you guys are doing it right. I'm like, who, who is this? Who, what have you done with BJ Shay, the mean, uh. acerbic, bitter Shay hole that I came to love? All said, listen, I don't know what your psych has got you on, but those pills are working. They are working. <laughs> That they lithium are is but here's what I want to say to Look you. Look at me smiling right here's now. Here's what I want to say to you, though. He wants to hug you. Because yeah. the first thing you came in the door, and I'm going to bust you on the same thing, because okay. look, as you get older, you know what happens. You That's said, true. Okay, you yeah, say, yeah, here's what right. you said. The first thing you said is, I want to say this. Even though I'm a Mexican that does coke, I don't do that much anymore. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> and I remember you when you came here. Oh, my God. And my God, I swear Coca-Cola called you and said, we want to make you a rep. <laughs> you were I looking for that. I literally skied in. <laughs> yes. On a slope of coke. <laughs> You know when you do that slide and it makes that a shh? I did that and then I snorted it. Yeah, all the way. <laughs> yeah, I, you know, this is not an exaggeration. And I, this is what I love about the Greg Wilson. And let, let's get your proper yes. intro. Steve really worked on a really oh, good I'm intro. Sorry, I spent all the proper I spent the last weekend writing this one. <laughs> well, it's been a while since we've had our next guest on. He's been banned by some comedy clubs here in Seattle. Yeah, that's true. And then I get this email from him saying, quote, It's been a while. Can't wait to see you shea holes again. <laughs> this time, I'm going to find that coke. That's Please right. welcome to the I show. Guess. There he is. The Greg Wilson. Yeah. Oh, Here we go. Do you remember? Right okay, do you remember looking oh for Coke God. at the Tacoma Dome? Yeah. During oh the rock goes down, like there's got to be some Coke in here somewhere. There were all those whores. None of them would give us Coke. <laughs> I was like, how can there be this many whores and no Coke? This is something unnatural. <laughs> like I felt like I was disappointing Motley Crue. That's what I felt like. Like somewhere Vince Neil was like, you guys just don't know what to do with all that rock oh girl, all that rock girl <laughs> booty. There, I think I had to get you, pull you, physically pull you off of the stage where the rock girls were, like yes, four or five. Time yeah, during the gala. There was no security. No, and my and, and you did some comedy before the, sun, I the did, show. I did. So everyone knocked it out in a park. Right, right. And then then you just had free reign, and also had free reign to the booze so that was awesome. backstage. Yes, and I found a bottle of Jack Daniels. Yes, you did. And I was trying to go into the girls' dressing so room, funny. and I was like, "No, BJ said." <laughs> Honestly, I like, I BJ Semi, he said he wants you to drink this Jack Daniels. And we had the poor intern who we said, your Derek. job. Yeah. Yes. Derek, you have to watch the Greg Wilson. And, and maybe on your blog today, Steve, you can post the video. Because we did have a video yeah, blog. That's one of our funniest oh. ones. But you got to include the video that I shot on the stage of the straight booty. Just I a, will. You're right. It's just a stream of oh, booty. Yeah. I lowered so the camera to, to, to ass height. Yes. And I just went. And it, was, it had to be 50 girls on stage at the time. Yep. And it's literally just 50 asses in a row. No face. No, it's all killer, no filler. No faces. <laughs> no, no knees. Okay? It is just ass. Ass after ass, right? And no one stopped me, so I just kept going. And, it was, it, and the it, whole oh. show was going on in front of the girls at the time. It was It was, It was. was really, it, it was It was one of the funnest times just because as a spectator, I love, I, I'm a spectator sport guy, I watch watching the Greg Wilson with the butt cam, the Greg Wilson running around looking for coke, and then the intern trying to corral the Greg Wilson. So he kept trying to stop me. He's like, you're not allowed to go in there. Like, ah, my PJ Tommy guy here. And every time it was like, oh, no, I've got clearance. And then, uh, here's, the, here's the intern. Uh, Greg, we really have to go now. Yeah, yeah, no, <laughs> the best part was after you're doing all that video, that's when finally my boss looks at me and goes, uh, Steve, you're going to have to get your friend off of the stage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and it, well, yes. if we forget the comedy club. Dude, I was with him oh. for that whole experience when we it was in Ballard. And you did a oh, comedy yeah. show. Yes, you did. And you, you killed it on stage. Fantastic. And I, remember, and I was waiting for you. I was like, oh, that's okay. that's right. I got busted where? doing blow in the girl's bathroom. Yeah, there we go. Right. That's gentlemen. right. I forgot about that. This is this was the show of shows, and here I am, and I'm waiting, and I'm waiting. I'm like, okay, well, we, we still got to go to Jolene's birthday party after yep. this, and I'm still waiting for Greg, and and then all of a sudden he's being escorted out, and I look at him like, what, what, what are you doing? And he looks at me, and goes, you're just gonna have to meet me outside. I'm being kicked out. 
Well, what it happened was, I'm such an idiot. God, you know, cocaine's a powerful drug. Uh, <laughs> that statement is so true. He was so right when he said it. Because I had done some of the coke, right? But I couldn't find a comfortable place to do the coke. Because yeah. the bathrooms at this place, the bar, the, the bathroom stalls, the doors didn't close. They were like 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 saloon doors that just went... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I couldn't get any privacy to do the coke. <laughs> so for some stupid reason, I thought, you know where it would be private? The manager's office. That's right. Oh. So, yes. So, like an idiot, I go to the manager. I'm like, hey, uh, you think I can use your office for a minute? Uh, and he's like, uh, what do you want my office for? I'm like, you know, I just, uh, you know, need it for a minute. You know? <laughs> and this is a rock club. This isn't even a comedy club. I know, it's a rock club. I figured just need it for a minute. Come on, just gotta, you know what's up. Come on, it's a rock club. Yeah, come on, it'll be cool, right? And it like dawns on him what I'm asking him. He's like, no, you can't do that in here. Now, when he said in here, I thought he meant just like in this room we were in right there. <laughs> I, didn't think, I didn't think he meant the whole damn bar. So I go into the. So then this girl, she's like, we can go do it in the girls' restroom. So she drags me in the girls' restroom, and we're literally now. And it would have worked, it would have been fine, but we didn't check to see if the restroom was empty before we went in there, and there was a girl in a stall. And so we're oh, in there. Geez, imagine being her sitting there and right, sitting there, this guy. Bring it up. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay? So then. <laughs> <laughs> she's cutting up the lines on the counter and the other girl walks out and sees it she's like <gasps> and then turns and when she opens the door to the bathroom the manager happens to be walking right by at that moment just perfect timing looks right in and we lock eyes and I just look at him like Hey! <laughs> I'm just in here. I uh, gotta go to the bathroom right now in the women's restroom. I have to do it seated. <laughs> and, and he just marched right in there. And she's like trying to gather the coke and put it away. She's literally trying to sweep it into her hand. I'm like, just throw it in my face. You know, like, just throw it. Like, I want to just throw it at you. I'll, I'll just sniff the air like, you know. And so. <laughs> He walks in, he's like, what are you, I'm like, I wasn't doing it. And that's when they just grabbed me by the shirt and threw me out of my own show. And then we hit the Soto area and we go to a Jolene's birthday party, our night, our night gal, and, and, and you just would not leave her alone. You just kept like hugging her and trying Can to, I tell you, you kept I trying have, to grope I, her and she was so I nice to no you. I have no recollection of that whatsoever. No, I know, you were gone. I have zero you recollection. Were, and finally I was like, Greg, I'm going to have to take you home. Okay, <laughs> I, you know what I probably needed to be taking, I was probably the right <laughs> Well, there was, like, there was like a whole you bunch of biker could've... dudes that were looking at you like, okay, he's messing with our friend. And oh, <laughs> she was boy. being nicer than anything. She didn't care. She was I've like, done it fine. so many times. Oh, oh man. And, I'm not and, good at it. And this is why... It's been so long for the Craig Wilson to come back. <laughs> I can't exactly. believe it. It's like the restraining order finally expired. It did. Uh, so I can, I'm, I'm back. I'm back in business. Oh, so it's the Tacoma Comedy Club tonight, tomorrow, two shows, 8 and 10.30 p.m. You can get info at TacomaComedyClub.com. I'm telling you, you do not want to miss this show. The BJ Shea Morning Experience on 99.9 KISW.